Hello my class 12 students, today we are going to start with chapter number 10, Swami's exams from your book Oakwood English. So let's begin. As exam approach, Swami Nath's father become fuzzy and difficult. He seemed all of a sudden to have made up his mind to harass his son. His father emphasized the consequences of failure. Swami Nath reflected about being left behind at school, everybody seemed to be overwhelmed by the thought of examination. Swaminath's friends P, Sankar, Rajam and Mani also felt the pressure. The P took time to grasp jokes and seldom gave out any. And as for Rajam's exhibits, a focused approach arriving and leaving school promptly while maintaining minimum interaction, Mani was beginning to look worried and took every opportunity to take Sankar aside and have his doubts cleared. Mani dodged the steps of school clerk. There was a general belief in the school that the clerk was omniscient and knew all the question papers of the classes. Money approaches the school clerk, a neat bundle containing fresh vegetable, hoping for hints from exam papers. The clerk looked extremely amiable and Money felt that he could ask anything at that moment and get it. Despite the clerk's reluctance, Money persistently flatters him. Eventually, extracting advice on focusing on geography, practicing map drawing, and solving arithmetic problems. The clerk remained vague about English. Satisfied money leaves convinced that his investment in bridges was not wasted. Students, let's know all the words that we learned today. First, fuzzy, which means choosy, difficult to please. Second, Harass, which means trouble or disturb. Third, reflected, which means thought. Fourth word, overwhelmed, which means occupied with the thought of. Fifth, grasp, which means understand. Sixth, dodged, which means determined. Seventh, omniscient, which means one who knows everything. That's it for the day, students. Bye-bye.